You're gonna want to be careful for uh, Nunu, obviously. So, what do you want to do? Are you gonna are you gonna hard shove this? I think I think hard shoving it, and trying to take like trade and get an early kill is gonna be best. I think that's the only way that I can really play into Mord. Yeah, and then like putting Vision deep into their uh, jungle. I think that's gonna be best here. Okay, well I just took a hit. You're. He, I hate junglers who do that. They don't step closer. Is he in this bush? It's not, it's not a lot of HP. It's okay. No, but it's just preference that I don't tank a tank a shot. Believe it or it not, it tells them. It tells them where uh, Nocturne is. Well, they're gonna know from botlane. Botlane didn't fake leash. Really, really focus this game on not using abilities as much, too. Uh, you want your abilities for trading. This is good. If you want it, you can kill this guy. So, right when you hit that parry, we should if we ignited before then, we would have been fine. We would have gotten the kill. But it's good. We want to get... We got the wave where we want it to be. This is good. Don't. Don't, no, don't put that, don't use that ward like that. We just, we just want to get this shoved. You have your, uh, your parry, you're okay. Get this wave pushed in, let's get out of here. We're going to go check on Nunu, see how he's doing. Let's go check their jungle. Just, we're going to go walk towards the blue buff here. Oh, there we go, we found him. So you can slide, yep, oh, good try. It was a good try. If you hit the parry, you get the kill. And that's okay. Now we know where he is, at least. So that's fine. What's the wave look like? Okay, we're good. Not bad. <clears throat> Have some confidence in your damage, by the way, on those on those early trades. That was a kill. Should I just gone for the flash Q? You could have, yeah. But you could have killed him a lot sooner. So when you were level 1 and he was level 2, he was walking up because he was hoping that the minions were going to get him level 2. And instead they started aggroing you, which stopped him from getting level 2. And he was dead the second that those minions turned around and started looking at you. Now this is, so notice how we, we, we backed and now we have an AD advantage, right? We have an AD advantage. We have more, we have uh, like the long sword and he's got no HP and he's forced to stay. We're definitely looking for any type of kill, right? So cut this, cut this down just a bit. Like take like two minions. Just remember if he walks up too close and he throws that E, slide parry into that E and stun him and kill him. Yep. He's going to want this. He's going to want this cannon. Okay, good. Yep, yep, yep. Just back off. We already missed it. Keep the... Let's make him stay. Keep taking these minions. Don't let this touch the tower. This is exactly where we wanted to stay. We wanted to stay right here. Don't He's use, ab don't use abilities. Don't use abilities. We need mana. Just start auto-attacking them. I don't know why he's invading. This is fine. This is good. Ignite back up in 16 seconds. Just keep this freeze. We'll eventually find our opportunity. And when we go for it, we ignite immediately. Ignite. He ignited now too. leave. Now leave. Now leave. Now leave. Or actually shove. Hard shove. Hard shove. Never mind. Hard shove. My bad. I was thinking it was going to come back to you. Which it would, but we can actually just hard shove it. It's fine. Because he doesn't have TP. He doesn't have anything. It's going to take him a while to get back. We want to get all these minions. So we need to push this as fast as possible. We want to get the next wave as well. Parry this wave.
and out. Refillable whip. Tear. Are no, you having Are you having mana issues? Because I don't think you are. Well, you told me if I don't buy tier early, you're gonna snap. You're gonna snap at me. You have presence of mind. I don't feel like you're having any mana issues this game. No. Yep. I think we're good. So we're prioritizing damage. We're gonna need it. So, notice how we literally almost have ignite up again. So we're gonna need that if we want to fight him again when he when he hits six. Okay. So now we're going to let this wave slowly push back. We're not really looking for the only trades we're taking are front side vital trades, and then we're out. We're going to slowly let this come back to us, and we're going to let him know. We're going to let our Nocturne know. We're just going to put two pings, like assist twice, real quick. Just put two assist pings down. No, don't go back there. You just took 120 damage from minions. I cancel them out. You're good. You're He's good. dead. No. Do you have this? Hard to shove it again. We don't need to freeze. We're trying to get as much gold as possible. Um, don't. Why did you queue to the back of a 20 man minion wave there? You lost 120 HP from that. I didn't. I, I don't know. I was trying to thin out the wave. Don't need to. We just needed to keep pushing towards us. Oh, that's a fast back. Hey, you know what? Fast back. Grab that Warhammer, baby. That was OP. Obviously not ideal, but that's fine. Um, yeah, don't don't go into the big min like the the minion wave. Let it let it come to us. We're only looking for front vitals, and we're looking for uh, the minions that are in the front that we can kill. Because we don't get we don't get to do that when the, the, he has all those minions. So you really got to think about don't uh, don't type don't get into a conversation. We're in a session. We're in a session. Um, you got to think about how much damage you take just for like queuing to the, the back. So 120 damage. I mean that's a whole auto, that's a whole auto attack or and some from him. You know what I mean? Yeah, I didn't. I autopiloted for a second. No, you're good, but that's something that people don't even think about, how much damage the minions actually do in those situations. So now we're looking for, this is going to be another kill opportunity. We're looking to catch this right, right, you know where we want it. We want it right in front of this rock here and just starting to get it. Just don't take damage. Look for front vitals, which this is, and we can take that as a trade. That's fine. Clear this up a little bit, and we're looking for any opportunity that we can ignite immediately and go for it. That's stuck. Nope. That's fine. This is good. We'll get our little reset. If he makes any mistake where he throws the E and we can get the stun, we go for it. Ignite. All right. Shove hard. I played that poorly. It's fine, though. All right, let's take one plate and get next wave. Next wave. Parry. We got parry. And then we have our whip. And we're out after this next one. Yep. All right, finish Gore Drinker. See how we don't need to worry about like tier because we're playing at a faster pace. Like, yeah. It's our lane, and we're gonna play it how we want to play it. So he doesn't get the choice to like do anything. Any, any, he takes any wrong step, we're going crazy. And then, so with the bloodline passive, we're getting like life steal from that too. Um, and when you fully stack it, it gives you 100 HP, like kind of like how overgrowth does. So it's really nice.
Let's cut it to four. Don't need to use abilities. Want to keep our mana. That's what I want you to practice on is hitting that, getting used to farming without using abilities. I mean, uh, on a freeze, I rarely will use abilities unless I'm trying to stack tier, but I don't have tier at the moment. This is fine. Until we know where he is, we don't make it. We don't make a play. We just keep this frozen. I don't know where Mord is at all. Yeah, we're just waiting to see where he is. There he is. You got a knight? Uh, You're looking for in 15 seconds. That's when we go for our kill. If we want to take some top side trades like that, that's that's okay. We can do those trades. Hold, hold, hold. Get ready. We're about to go for it. Well, we can get a five vital. We want a five vital for it. So okay. hit level hit level ten actually, and then go for it. This is it. This is your opportunity. That's fine. You can go for it. Ignite. That still hits. Oh, I well, short. Good. I shorted my uh, my cube. Let's go get these minions. Let's get it shoving. Shove this shit. Let's go get a plate. Parry this wave and then uh, hit it with a... Well, that's fine. Clear it, and then we're out. We leave. You can back right here, nobody's gonna stop you, you're good. Well, maybe. Wait, actually, he's not. This is perfect. Thank you, Mord. All right. Uh, what's their... Love. Get, get, go for them all. Go for them all. Go for them all. Start building them all. Let me see the wave. We only lost one? Nice. We lost one minion. That's good. Let's go help my boy. Yep. While you're down, don't do not do that with, uh, ward next time. So start saving. Um, if, you, if you're if you not going to buy control wards, then we need to... Uh, hmm. We need to be putting wards in their jungle. What the fuck? Uh, I don't like this fight. That's why I don't like that fight. I live. So, the better play would have been to just go and get the blue buff once you saw three of them there, take the blue buff and go back to the top. There's nothing that I can do here. Nope, we're wasting time, honestly. We should we should be back at the top. Oh, that hit. I'm kind of wondering what my team is doing. Why didn't because we? That was... So that's fine, but you gotta, you gotta ulti immediately. I, yeah. Like he should've been able to get both of them. We don't care about we don't we don't worry about our team. We're good. It's fine. Do I go top or bot? Uh, you can catch a bot wave if you'd like. 
or you can go top. You can go either here. It doesn't really, there is no real preference. It's probably safer for you to go uh, bot, like for a team perspective, but. What's his items? Okay, he's still killable. We can just go ahead and just run right into him and kill him, honestly. Yeah, we can probably just save Ignite, huh? All right, shove hard. Let's get this. Uh, let's get this tower. You got seven seconds until Akali gets here. She's going no, back Akali's to mid. Going back. I do not want to be fighting this yet. Cause she is four and one. Now go mid. Like keep putting, like keep putting pressure on the map. Look for a kill. Where's she going? Okay, she running away. Now we go back, go back, get this bottom wave. Like just always be thinking. Where are we going next? You know what I mean? It looked like she was getting kited out towards you from mid. So now we're taking this. Let's go put some damage on the tower until we see somebody. We see two mid. Ash is still here. Look at mid. Is mid is is there anything we can do mid? Like instantly just like click it. Like click mid and then look at it and then you'll see and if not you can turn around. Alright. So we saw now we know two are bot. We can either decide to sit in this bush that's right to our left and see if we can get a pick on them rotating. I should have been there quicker. Uh-huh. So now, so now we would go. We would have gone back to bot the second that we got that we got vision on us, right? I can go bot right now. Yeah, we just got to keep thinking, keep thinking, keep being proactive on the map. Is that is that fruit still up down there? Is that fruit still up? No. The one that's down. It's right there. Oh. Back to bot. Remember, we're about to have to fight for dragons, so don't use too much mana. So you've got Ignite. Right now, you should be looking at your who your kill prio is. And I think it's Akali, to be honest, or Ash. Couldn't get R out. Go, go, go. Go. Cut. Yep. Cut a collie. Alt. 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 She's dead. Get this tower. And my team is doing well. Tower and next wave. Hold this for two seconds. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Stop attacking. Just for a second. Just for a second. You'll see why. Just stop attacking for a second. Last hit these. I want this. I, I just don't want. I want the wave. To, go catch the wave. Go catch the wave. I don't want the wave to be under the tower. I want the wave to be oh, outside oh, of the tower. Oh, oh, oh. Gotcha. So that you can get this wave as well without being stuck under the tower. Because then if somebody shows up, then you can't get the wave. Alright. Now we're good. Now we're out. We're out. We're out. We're fine. We're fine. We have 2700 gold. We have no mana in 2700 gold. We don't need to be here. You're actually, uh, you're actually gonna take Merc treads, no cap. Yeah, finish that. You're gonna take Merc treads for the all these slows that they got, and then we're gonna go ahead and work on our death stance now. Do you see what I meant when I said to stop attacking so that the wave wouldn't, like, be under the tower? Yes. Let's go see if that blue buff's up. 
Okay, what items do these these guys have? Shield bow, eclipse, two and go. Yeah, okay. Go get this wave. I was gonna say go over the wall and see if you could get something going, but it's fine. They're gonna rotate to that. So now we're we're looking for this tower. By the way, once your landing phase is over, start grabbing blue wards. Oh, I usually do by now. I forgot. Two dead. This is our tower. Watch this fight while you're hitting this. Like, I want to see you start like using your your thing a little bit more. Like looking at the map. Just so you know what's going on. Okay. That's an ace. You can go. You can keep going. You're fine. They're gonna. Re they're, they have to pick you or them. It makes it better for your team here if you make them pick between both. Remember these. These go for this. Look at the, look at the fight. Look at the fight though. Like go for this, but look at the fight. Where are you going? Just get out. Everybody's about to be up. Just let her die. Look at the blue buff. Is the blue buff up? Yeah. All right, we get this blue buff quickly. You gotta remember that the, those those base towers move in tiers. So if you get it down to sixty six percent, it stays at that and it won't heal past that. And if you get it, you get it down to thirty three, it won't heal past that either. So there's no pride. There's no uh, take these uh, chickens. There's no real gain from trying to fight those two under the tower when those guys are just going to come up and then you just waste the time. You're really just trying to get that tower down to like 66 or 33 and if you know that you can do it, then you go for it. What's dragon timer? 110. Cool. Let's get, uh, let's get a warhammer and the uh, chain vest. Yep. Now we're gonna posture towards bot lane. Let this top lane build up, because we're gonna win this. We're gonna win this bot lane fight, either end game or we're gonna go top and go collect fucking forty minions that are gonna be on that two tier tower, and then we're gonna be full build and then the game's over. Two steps ahead, always. We're gonna let that top wave build for us in case things go wrong and we need a backup to get some gold. No jinx. Ping her off that. Ping dragon. Ping dragon. Look at it, Kali, look at the fight, they're fighting. Just keep, just keep paying attention. You can keep farming, but pay attention and be ready to help, because this is going to be game ending. This is where we can end the game if we win this fight. Is Dragon up? Then we need to move. Play flank, you're strong. Play this side, play this side, go around, don't front to back, don't know. I'm saying like go around the uh, other way. We want to play flank, we want to play flank in this fight. Because we have Nocturne. We're looking to kill the uh, back line with Nocturne. Anybody that you can two-shot here. Anybody. Senna. Ash. 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 Ult. You have Flash. You're fine. Alright. What what's going on in the fight? They're already dead. Go end game. End game. End game. End game. End game. Even if you can't end, at least pressure her to, like, make a decision here. She's done. Ulti in five. Keep running. Fuck Mouse. He's not your problem. Stay here. Stay here for a second. Like, don't keep running. Like, look for an opportunity. You might have one. Look at this. You could probably go back in. Couldn't you? Or at least put pressure. Fucking that's, ash. That's fine. Look at your team. You needed to put pressure down. They're doing the, the Baron. You yeah. had to do that. Okay. Death dance. 
And now let me see it. Let me see their team, their items. I give you permission to build Tiamat. Get a Ravenous. Let's go crazy damage on them. If they're double crit, will they take Randuins? If not, we're just going to go ahead and get more they, damage. I mean, they have Rapid Fire, and they have this, so it is double crit. Nah, but it's not double crit. You know, it's Senna. Like, she's building more crit items. This is going to be something. You'll see. We'll see if we need it in the long run. Right now, I don't think we do. So, something from the last no, game. No, not all bot. We can all bot if we want to. I don't want them to. There's no reason to, I think. Because if we 5v5, we lose. Because uh, Miles will get picked off. No, we won't. We, I don't think you lose 5v5 right now, to be honest. It's fine to do it either way. You can 5-man it, or you can 4-1 it. Just waste their time. Yo, no, just waste their time. You're good. This is good. Now come back. Don't let him back. This game is over if you just keep him here. Just keep following him. And now, now that he's gotten like Q through, and let's see what he decides to do. Yep. Ignite, ignite, ignite. You can kill that. All game's over. You can definitely kill that with ignite. All right, you know how this goes. Time for me to type up notes. Let me see the damage charts. Good. Let me see the CS. Good. 185. Good job. No, I think you're getting better. I think they're, uh, like I was saying earlier, I like doing the, uh, the sessions with you because your mistakes are simple. Do you know what I mean? Your mistakes aren't yeah. that deep. They're very, uh, they're very, what's the, like, that's not even a good word like mainstream but it's just it's easy to see them and it They're makes very it very easy to see yeah. yeah and it makes it easier to talk about and we can just be like holy shit that's right in our face it's perfect you know okay um but yeah i'm sure we'll do another one eventually so uh Absolutely. i hope you have a great night good job man and uh you. yeah good session you have yourself a good night and good luck hey thank you good luck on your climb as well brother bye-bye Alrighty. bye-bye